Now at five, a Milwaukee family had plans to celebrate their first Easter in a new home. Instead, they were counting bullet holes. Taylor Lumpkin joins us live outside the home that was fired on dozens of times. Taylor. Steve, this is what the home currently looks like with dozens of bullet holes just like this one riddled throughout the house marked with red tape. And we're told this all happened because of an argument. People should just put the guns down, honestly. James Cooper and his younger brother just moved into this home on Friday near the corner of 28th and Brown. Two days later, their house was shot at nearly 30 times in broad daylight. I'm like, wait, those gunshots. And I looked at the house and there was bullet holes in the house. According to Milwaukee police, the shooting took place Easter morning. James says the shooting happened after an argument between his brother and another person. They left and then 10 minutes later, it was somebody shooting right here in the middle of the street. Shaquan Dickerson lives across the street. He says he's been in the area for 12 years and has never seen anything like this before. When we were growing up here, it was peaceful. Uh, kids would be out in the communities outside. I'm tired of the shootings, to be honest. It's, there's no point. You know, life, life loss is nothing gained, you know. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but Walter Love, the landlord of the home, says he's fed up with the violence and wants city officials to do more to stop it. Our city is being overran by people who don't feel like the law applies to them. We got to get strong on prosecuting these, these criminals out here. Police say right now no one has been arrested in connection with the shooting. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4 News.